Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. First, let's meet the San Diego Beer Men. Another solid frontliner on the San Miguel beer roster. He's best remembered for his string of eight consecutive finals appearances with three different teams starting in 1995. Standing six foot seven, number 24, Chris Jumbo Molado. Hi, welcome to my channel and this is episode 345 of our Grape Tour of the Fino series. In this episode, we travel to historic town of Lukban, the art, dance and rice capital of Quezon province, in search of notable individuals like our heroes, famous celebrities, musicians, politicians, athletes and businessmen interred in this part of southern Tagalog region. Come join us to remember, celebrate the life, and visit the final resting place of a professional basketball player that played in PBA for about 10 years from 1994 to 2003. Located in a section next to the main road, we found the final resting place of professional basketball player Chris Bolado. Chris Santo Igualada Bolado, or popularly known as Chris Bolado, was born on the 25th October 1969 in Lukban, Quezon. He was a professional basketball player at PBA with a height of 6'7 or 201 centimeters and played as center. Bolado was tagged as Jumbo due to his height and size and also as the lucky charm because of his 11 championship appearances in his 10-year career in PBA for 7 different teams. Bolado played in early 1990s in UAAP for NU Bulldogs basketball team. In 1994, Bolado was part of the second round of PBA draft and was the 13th overall pick by Alaska Milkman. Bolado played in PBA for Alaska from 1994 to 1997. During his playing years with Alaska, he was part of the team when the franchise won the 1994 Governor's Cup against Swift, 1995 Governor's Cup against San Miguel. Ball is knocked out. Here's Bolado and Edwinio. Edwinio will sit down. Bolado steps in. So some giants. A token attempt of defense by Jorge Lastimosa and Volado. The ring it called for the foul. That would be just a few players. Volado at the side. And 1996 as Grand Slam winner against Pure Food, Shell, and Ginebra. At center, number 24, Chris Volado. The club's top shot locker. Bongrabena, bounce pass to Rodriguez inside. Uh, to Chris Bolado, umamin ka agad. Oh, oh, ako may sala, sabi ni Chris Bolado. Uh, Hawkins, Hawkins, Chris Bolado, yes! Paborito, paborito ang spot ni Chris Bolado. Pag nakuha niya dyan ang bola, he will take it strong to the hoop. At wala makakapigil dyan si Chris Bolado pagka gumalaw na nagyan. In 1997, he was traded and moved to Pure Foods. During his short stint with Pure Foods, he was part of the team when the franchise won the 1997 All-Filipino Cup Finals against Ginebra and Gordon Kings. Well, Chris Bolado is not going to beat Marlo Aquino 15 feet away from the basket. Bukas si Chris Bolado ang espalda bit. Yes. Ayan, sigurado na yun. Marlo Aquino turning around. Ando ng depensa ng Pure Food. Pero wala pa rin sila sa penalty. But already three personal fouls. No? Bolado again moved to Gordon's team, which he played for two seasons in years 1997 and 1998. So dahil usually mas agresibo to sa Ali Pink. Pero so far, it's only had six points. Pero ayun, si Ali Pink tried to go for that shot. Ah... Like, uh, 
Al Nasser is still sick to go to Mali. He is still able to draw out the defense of a player than Pat Kola. As far as uh, the front line is concerned by uh, Coach Sonny Jowitsky in the presence of Marlo Aquino. Bolado later joined San Miguel Beerman after he was traded from Pop Cola and played for the 1999 seasons. During his short stint with San Miguel, he was part of the team when the franchise won the 1999 Commissioner's Cup against Shell and the 1999 Governor's Cup against Alaska. In year 2000, Bolado played for Batang Red Bull team. Finally, he joined Coca-Cola Tigers and played for two seasons in years 2002 and 2003. He was part of the team when the franchise won its first ever PBA championship in the 2002 PBA All-Filipino Cup against Alaska and the 2003 Reinforced Conference Finals against San Miguel. After his 10 years playing career in PBA with 11 championship titles in 7 different teams, Bolado decided to retire in 2003. During his retirement years, Bolado also appeared in some TV and movies as actor. These were 1998, Anting Anting starring Michael V with Jessa Zaragoza and Edu Manzano. 2009 TV reality show Survivor Philippines Palau, as hosted by Paolo Bijones and aired over GMA7. <laughs> Castaway na natanggal sa kanyang tribo sa Survivor Philippines pala. Chris. Marami ang nagulat sa pagkakatanggal ni Chris Bolado ng niya na sa pagkakataong ito ay hindi gold survivor. Para doon, hindi talaga. Pero kahit wala na ako sa loob, yung puso ko na sa Survivor pa rin. Natalo man sa Survivor, tiyak na may bagong panalong darating. Di sa isla. Kung mangyayari sa itong buhay, di ba? Lalong tumiba yung ano. Yung tiwala sa sarili. And 2013, The Fighting Chef, starring Ronnie Ricketts and Chef Boy Logro, with Joros Gamboa and Hero Angeles. <laughs> Ngayon nakilala mo na ang tip ko. Ha? Tip ha? Wallet, tayaram. 50! Negative! 800! Tandang-tanda mo pa! Ang galing mo ba? 200? Ito na ang tip mo sa amin! Excuse me! Halika na darling! In 2013, Bolado and his wife moved to Cambodia to work as basketball coach in an international school in Phnom Penh and managed a Filipino restaurant in Cambodia called Inasal Nation. On the 17th September 2017, Bolado met an untimely death when he was involved in a fatal motorcycle accident in Cambodia. He died from his injuries sustained at the age of just 47. In the next episodes, we will post the video of the continuation of our visit of Manila North Cemetery and living in mga bayani in Taguig. Later in this channel, we will also post more grateful videos including Loyola Memorial Park and Manila Memorial Park in Paranaque. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe if you like my channel. See you in our next Grape Tour of the Famous Episodes.